so hello everyone welcome back to the channel and you're watching komal taya so guys today i'm not going to teach you anything today i'm going to crack down some revision strategy for for you guys for this november 2020 exam that is chemical sciences exams right exam and guys uh you know these days the last days are very crucial and they play a very important role for your exam right and why i'm making one video on revision because i think if you have studied everything and if you have studied everything rigorously and you have not done revision then there is no use to give you, give even exam because half of them half of things will blank out in the exam if you are going without revision right so it's my advice to you that for now just leave everything and go and revise your stuff because if you have read anything before 2 months 3 months and you are not reading it again so it will be like a heap and you will be completely blank out in the exam right so uh, for so first of all i'm going to start my video with those students who have not done previous year questions yet right so under that comes two categories so people who have not done previous year questions so now i am going to cat sub categorize it into two categories that is now people who are not done previous year question the first category is people who have done revision like you know that your revision is full uh, full proof and full concrete right and you can go into the exam without even revising your stuff because you have revised your things so much and so for this is for uh, repeaters who are uh, repeating the exams again and again so they must be knowing everything right so if you have not done previous year questions and your revision it's full proof so what you need to do just try previous year questions for 10 days right so just do those uh, do uh, previous year question for 10 days and that's it you don't have to do anything right so another thing um for the la last 3 days i'll be telling in the upcoming phase of the video that what you need to do so be be in the uh, be till the end so i'll be discussing that so first let me just categorize into the second category so for people who have who have not done previous year questions neither previous year question and nor any revision and it means their preparation is not that up to the mark so it's my advice for you guys don't touch previous year question at this this moment because only 10 days or 10 to 12 days are remaining right so there is no use to see some new new things because you will get panicked you will you will be very scared after seeing some new things and some new concepts so there is no use to touch that thing so the better is whatever you have done till now just revise that stuff and go with that right so just give you 100% in the revision because uh, previous year question will scare you off at this moment because your revision is not done your previous year question is not done so better is to do revision right So this is for uh, all type of categories, right? So now I'm going to crack these ten days into seven plus three days, right? So first ten days. So now I'm going to tell you that how to do revision for seven days for first seven days, right? So guys, what you have to do? It's not like it's not like you have to. go into deep things and you are just taking like a uh, half an hour one an hour for three to four pages it's not like that that's not how revision is done it's not like that please 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 pay attention over it you you just have to do what you have to do that you just have to take a glance over it it's like just to that okay you have read this and okay that you are just brushing things up on the surface that's it and if you're like if you're reading any formula like that and if it is in your head memorize it in your head and that's it you just have to see okay like suppose if this is the notebook if this is the notebook and i have to is this is the notebook if i have to see suppose there are four formulas one hair one hair one hair and one hair so what i'll do i can i can show you like that one hair one hair one hair and one hair so what i'll do i'll just take a glance over it just hair and hair and hair the most important things because competitive exams are not like your regular exams right so they are like they are designed in that way because they are going to check your capabilities right so whatever theory part is there in that thing suppose in formula formula wise question so you don't have to do such uh, you don't have to go in such deep things right so just brush things up from the surface only and you will be good to go i think that's how you need to uh, do revision and one more thing for 6 and 7 days whatever theory based things are there like uh, coordination and all coordination topic like these topics keep it for for the later phase of 7 days like for 6 day for 7 day right and one more thing 
प्लीज प्री प्लान एवरी थिंग सपोज यू हैव सपोज यू हैव थर्टी टॉपिक्स यू आर यू हैव प्रिपेयर थर्टी टॉपिक्स सो जस्ट डिवाइड दैम डिवाइड द रिविजन फ्रॉम दैम दैट ओके आई हैव टू डिवाइड थर्टी टॉपिक्स इन सेवन डेज और ट्वेंटी फाइव टॉपिक्स लाइक इफ यू आर लिविंग दोज फाइव टॉपिक्स फॉर अनदर थ्री डेज सो इन सेवन डेज सपोज यू आर डूइंग ट्वेंटी फाइव टॉपिक और थर्टी टॉपिक टॉपिक अकॉर्डिंग टू योर वे सो यू हैव टू डिजाइन इट दैट इन वन डे हाउ मेनी टॉपिक्स आई नीड टू कवर राइट सो इन दैट वे योर मेंटल प्रेशर इट्स इट शुड नॉट बी लाइक दैट लाइक इन वन टू टू डेज यू आर जस्ट रिवाइजिंग थ्री टू फोर चैप्टर्स एंड आफ्टर लाइक वैन यू आर ऑन फिफ्थ डे एंड सिक्स डे यू आर ओनली डन विद ओनली लाइक टेन टू फिफ्टीन चैप्टर्स एंड यू विल बी लाइक ओ माई गॉड यू आर पेनिकिंग इट दैट मोमेंट जस्ट प्री प्लान एवरी थिंग that for 7 days how much time it is going to take for you to complete those chapters so just just even if it is taking for you to complete four chapters in a day do it because you have you just have to take a glance because you have already studied it you have already read it clear so this is you have to do revision in that manner otherwise everything is going to in waste right so now uh, comes down to third point that is about last three days strategy so what you have to do in last three days so you have to literally like the things which you have to mug up that you have to keep that in the later phase of 3 days like the 3 days later phase of 10 days like in the 3 days you have to suppose you have to mug up some things like i'm going to take some example you have to do those things in the last 3 days so what are those so the first thing is reagents like the what what reagent is used for that right right so like uh, what is for uh, uh, kmno4 like that right so what is uh, kmno4 how kmno4 is used h2 palladium is used like that right so where it is it is used so like that and one more thing suppose ir values you have to revise ir values at that moment because these things these small small things we just uh, we just forget them right so keep these small small things in the end and other thing also like in if i talk about uh, solid state so you can take like structure of nacl structure of zinc blend diamond like this you have to just see how like what is the ratio what is the coordination number right so you just need to see how many like octa octahedral tetrahedral voids are there and where uh, where and suppose in case of nacl where cl is present where na is present so that you can find out octahedral voids and tetrahedral voids right so one more thing like if you take f block polymers you have to do it in the last last moment and if i talk about coordination chemistry coordination chemistry you have to uh, revise this thing water exchange thing like water exchange order that is very important from examination point of view and uh, one more thing uh, the application of cfsc like how lattice energy uh, increases decreases in the 3d series like with 3d series like that lattice energy and hydration energy it's like that right so and one more thing like for people who have read ajay kumar the last chapter of ajay kumar book that is inner sphere outer sphere mechanism revise everything from that because ditto question come from there so people who have already read it please read it again right so this will help you i'm i'm pretty sure this will help you in the exam and one more thing ogle diagrams ogle diagram data from ajay kumar book just just mug up everything because sometimes data also come in the exam right so what you have to do just mug up the data and ogle diagram right so if you have any query like i have made notes of ogle diagram like very uh, short notes so that i shared in my telegram group if you want so i can share with you also so just join the telegram group and And I'll be give so just ask for that and I'll be giving to you right and one more thing uh, bio inorganic so important things of bio inorganic that, that carbonic and hydrase and these all things all these things right these different type of enzymes and organo metallics so I talk about organo metallics just see Wilkinson catalyst and like that clear and some important reactions and uh, one more thing I'm forgetting one thing. which is wait let me just see over here because i'm uh, yeah yeah like important if you think that you are weak in formulas you are in weak in formulas so just uh, just take a look over the formulas and uh, one more thing esr mosbior these topics are very important so just take a look because people get confused between esr and mosbior so just uh, clear your concepts again and this will help you obviously and uh, one more thing and you have to do some things like uh, 
yeah enzyme catalysis enzyme catalysis always question is there so revise some formulas from enzyme catalysis and term symbols and all and uh, in in and from quantum most of the time huckel's molecular orbital theory question comes from there so just see how energy level uh, energy levels are distributed in case of benzene in case of cyclobutadiene in case of cyclopropene like that in all the cases that are mentioned in in the books in the prescri prescribed books only five to six systems are there and you'll be good to go like how to find delocalization energy and like that right so i hope i'll be able to complete it like before these 10 days so i'm making lectures so i'm thinking that i'll be able to i should cover huckel molecular orbital theory so i'm thinking to teach that so that nobody misses on that part because that is very important from examination point of view so i'll try to cover that for you guys so people who do, does who are freaking out that we does not know like delocalization energy or like that how to find that how total pi bond energy or like that so i'll be covering that for you clear so i think that is how revision should be done for these 10 days because this exam is most of like smart work not of hard work i'm just like like hard work obviously it, it is appreciable but this exam is most of hard because of uh, most of smart work because when choice based exam comes then smart works clicks in right so you just have to Think you have just have to systemize your things very wisely, right? Because you 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 can't miss miss out on small small things, and you are just uh, freaking out in exams because of these small things and just regretting that I wish I could have done like that. So just do just be calm, just do your revision very wisely in a, in a very planned manner, and I just hope you will be making it and uh, in a very nice manner. So I think that's it for this one. I also teach on my channel. You can see, you can check out my lectures. So that I have covered quantum. I'm covering quantum basically. So you can just check those. You can just. Uh, Join my telegram group link will be given in the description box and uh, I'll see all of you in the next one till then bye and take care bye